Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of an Aussie Farming in the Philippines. We're going into town, we've got to get some more stuff. We're going to be making some more German stuff, sausage meat stuff. We're going to use the press. We're going to use the press today. You got a special call out first, hun? Oh yes, it's the birthday of Gina. Gina! Yeah, the lovely lady of Nigel Corno. They're on like um, honeymoon today for her birthday. Mm. Very special occasion. Happy birthday, Gina, Happy from birthday. us in the farm. Happy birthday, Gina. Happy birthday. And what's the partner's name? Nigel Corno. Nigel. I don't know if I say it properly. Corno. For now. And she's got a Filipino squeaky voice up. Yeah, you take this, I'll grab the gate. Right. See you down at the gate. Alright guys, we're gonna head into town and see what we can do. Right guys, here we are. Look at this. A, a, a decent real car. A real car, baby. Yeah. Have a look at that. Luxury. <laughs> Absolute fucking luxury. Luxury, luxury, luxury. Right guys, so we're at Mama's store. We've got to pay Mama for some paint that's gonna be delivered. We got some of that special rust paint that they see advertised on YouTube. So um, I wanted to try that on the front gate and in two gutter areas. So we're going to drop some money off to Mama's store here. Well, it's Chick's store, Chick's house, Chick's land. So what's on your t-shirt today, mate? Oh, no. Hey, Joe. I'm a big German. <laughs> I like that. I like the humor. I like the humor. Very, very good. Hello. Hi, Mama. How are you? Hello. I'm how enjoying you? us. <laughs> See his Papa. Papa over here. Papa's digging. He's got his Vietnam T-shirt on. Green means I can go. Yellow means I can go. And red means I still can go. So they've they fenced all this off now. They've put um, all this lumber across the sides. I don't know what's happened there. I don't know what's happened there. That goes all the way down. Look at that. Wow. So they blocked off the house over there. I'll have to talk to Popper and see what it's about. And someone else has got a new chicken run in the back there. This ain't Popper's land, but the people let Popper use it because he keeps it maintained. Otherwise it'll just be very long grass and it'll be shitful. So they let Popper use it for free. And uh, it's kept after, it's looked after and everything's good. Gotta be happy with that, hey? Right, so here we are, we've got our shopping list. We've got our shopping list, we're at City Hardware, guys. So we're gonna go in here, have a look-see round and so forth, and get some things we need for some cooking. Yes, it sounds strange, but we need something. One of my machines got a little bit screw loosed. So hopefully we can get something. Let's go and have a look. Hello, you. Right, guys, well, guess where we are? How are you? Who's this guy over here? Hey, good morning. How are you? So we got Noel with us, Panobo Noel. He's got his wife Bliss over here. We got Chick Chick. We've got this guy. I don't know who he is. Just a fucking ringing. I don't know who he is. But um, we've just popped in to say hello to Noel on the way home from doing the shopping. And of course, grab a little coldie. There's nothing like a little coldie. A new lager. A new lager. So we're just coming for a taste test before we go home. So there you go. Right, guys. So what the hell is this here? Now, if it was my place, it would be full of pork from the processing, full of hams and sausages and bacon and all that. But at Noel's place, oh my God, FMG. What you got in here, big We've boy? We've got a beer in here. This is where we keep our chilled beer. Oh, look at this. Look at this. So this is your gas? Yeah, CO2 in here. Yeah. 18 litres. 19, yeah. 19? Yeah. Uh, Wowza. Yeah. Original from Coca-Cola. What a waste of a freezer yeah. putting beer in there, hey? What a waste of a freezer putting beer in there. Oh, no <laughs> It's easy to clean. And how does it come out of there, mate? How do you get it out? I just sit here with a little picnic tap, and I just uh, just pour my beer as I need it in the evening. Look at that. Nice, nice clean pour. Comes out of the keg. It's under about 12... 12 pounds pressure. Mm. And it's a, a nice, nice cool lager. There you go, guys. Got to be happy with that. See? Live your dream, guys. If you've got your dream, you can live the dream. Don't sit back and hold back and say, I can't do that. Noel's doing it. You're still trying. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Right, guys. So we're back into the village again. We left Noel's place. So Andrews Martin is just so amazed at the beautiful roads or <laughs> tracks, as he calls them. So uh, our track at the other end where we normally come down, it's uh, washed out pretty bad. So we've got to do a loop and come around behind our property 
and come back in this way so it's double the distance triple the distance but uh, that's a good road mate yeah i know i know <laughs> when you want to probe your car uh, don't use this. i'll get it baby all right so there you go guys this is a nice day out for us and uh gonna get back in and get some hooting done catch us all later